So here are, is an auger. And because our ground was so rocky, it's got actually a, a screw type auger end on that. But uh, because our ground's so rocky, we couldn't really get it into the ground. So if you look down in there, there's actually a little bit of concrete in there. I just put a little quick crete in there. And that runs up to that collar up there, and there's four of those to protect it from blowing in any direction. And this was actually pretty a pretty easy install. And here's a pipe down here, the end of the pipe. It actually screws into a, a T, and there's a horizontal piece of pipe. You can see the end of right there. So it's kind of a T with the uh, top of the T on the ground and uh, some rocks just to stabilize it down here. And the wire runs out from that, from the bottom of that. Uh, that was probably the hardest part of the whole thing. I, I had to have a metal worker friend drill a hole so I could get the wire out of that thing. There's also a lightning arrestor at the bottom of this. And then it one, just one runs through a conduit down to the shed right where I showed you. And there is the generator. And it gets cooking. We get uh, regular breezes, or wind if you want to call it, every night really. Uh, the downslope winds as it cools off and in the morning as it warms up, the wind blows. In fact, uh, it's going to start here. We get it every afternoon about 10 miles an hour. So that'll generate probably 40 or 60 watts steadily. So that'll run, you know, a couple light bulbs maybe my computer so it's worth it it's worth it and it, it was wasn't a bad install and it's a good investment while we're out here why don't I just show you why we live here I'm about to run out of battery anyway there's our neighbors set up it's identical to ours actually there's an old ski resort that's closed down and there's the lake That's a big reason why we live here, and why we live off the grid. So that we can have a view like this, live on our own, master of our own destiny. This is why we do it. And uh, today's 4th of July. Happy Independence Day. Time for me to crack a beer and maybe get on the lake. <laughs>